stand of the Publications Office of the European Union at the Frankfurt Book Fair. The Publications Office publishes since 1952 the EU law and the publications from all institutions, agencies and other bodies of the European Union. But how can people access this information? Well, the Publications Office manages four websites. Let's discover them with all my colleagues. My name is Paula Pepe and I work for the Publications Office and this is Carl Ferrand from the first service, Cordis. Carl, how does it work with Cordis? What is this and who can use it? So Cordis is the European Commission's Community Research and Development Information Service. Uh, it's been available since 1990 and it collects all the projects uh, that are funded under the EU's research framework programs. Let's now discover the second website managed by the European Union Publications Office, which is Eurlex. And to explain that, we have here Madame Pascal Berthelot. Please, Madame Berthelot, can you explain to the public what is Eurlex? Well, first we have to know that EU law is very important, that it's an important source of law in all 27 member states. Uh, so uh, ULEX is the central database which gives access not only to legislation but also to case law and to other documents around the law and which uh, is the symbol of democracy because it gives the citizen the access to EU, uh, EU law. Let's discover now the third online service of the Publications Office which is called TED and we have here my colleague Glenn Campbell. Glenn, what is TED? TED stands for Tenders Electronic Daily. It's the electronic marketplace for public procurement opportunities, uh, business opportunities in the EU and in the European economic area and even beyond. We have discovered three services, TED, Eurlex and Cordis. It's now the turn of EU Bookshop, the online digital library of the European Union. On EU Bookshop, you can browse among 85,000 titles in more than 23 languages and you can download free PDF or order paper copies. All this is for free. As you can see, there is a lot we can offer you through our websites. In case of questions, do not hesitate to contact us. So thank you and goodbye from the Frankfurt Book Fair 2011.